together and uh, we got guys uh, coming in on 10 days just trying our best to so help everybody. Uh, just for me, I just got in here, so I mean, I'm just trying to get, get with the coaches and uh, just, just get, get a lot of help from our, from our teammates and the guys that have been here. Uh, it's having fun and competing. A lot of guys got something to prove that's playing right now. I mean, that's part of the edge that we have right now. You were very passive. Yeah, he had 33 points in career passes. What happened to the offense? He did that tonight. Uh, just being in the tackle, like, I, like I've always been. And, uh, just believing in him. More of my teammates believe in him. And uh, throughout the games that I've been in, I've been so, so, so consistent. And uh, just trying to help, help everybody, and they helping me at the same time. Man. I'm learning a lot from a lot of guys on this team. We got a lot of good defenders. And, uh, watching, watching them on film, watching TA, watching Matt Barnes and how they get into guys and how they be in the gaps. And, uh, just being smart on defense, that's what helped me so much. You know, playing defense and the offense just come. Do you feel like you had to maybe step up with what's been going on? Uh, I mean, it's, I mean, it's gonna be somebody in every game is gonna somebody gonna have to step up and be that guy. And it's just today was my day, and uh, I know somebody else gonna step up too. Uh, we just gotta believe in each other and just play hard. What the past 24 hours have been like for you? I don't even think it's a word in a dictionary, a phrase in a book that can explain the the way I feel. Like just yeah, boy. getting that opportunity. So like. Yeah, I can't, boy, I can't, I can't even tell you how that feels. Like I just had to go out there and do what I do. And you had the ball in crunch time too. I mean, with you know, with the clock winding down. I mean, again, oh, yeah. that's that's yeah. that's play, playground stuff. For sure. I mean, it's um, run the team, point guards, get people to where they need to get, and get the get the ball to the people who need to get the ball. What did Vince say to you right before you went out on the court? He said, "Just take it, take it in, young fella. It's gonna." It's gonna be some ups and downs. It ain't gonna be perfect, but just keep playing your game and, and do do what you do. What be, you, be you, be you. What did that mean to hear that from you? Yeah. Once again, there's no yeah. words in the dictionary. Like one of my favorite players growing up, like I idolized him. I want every time I had a play school hoop, I was doing Vince dunks and all that. So that meant a lot. Like I'm gonna take that to the grave with me. How much offense did you know? Uh, I mean, it's NBA. Most people run the same stuff, so I knew some of the concepts, just different terminology. So I had to just lock in and understand what what some of the term, the different terminologies were. So it, it wasn't that it wasn't that tough, but it was kind of rough. Oh. Well. At what point did you feel comfortable? You had to learn your So what, or were you ever comfortable? <laughs> I mean, it's basketball at the same time. I mean, had a little jitters, butterflies, but it's all coming from a good place. And, um, I was comfortable just because teammates behind me, it was, it was behind me, ten, ten, ten toes down. So they held me down, they talked to me, and just let me know that, you know what I'm saying, you're going to be good, you know, just keep playing. What did Coach tell you about how much you would be used and, and were you surprised by the 40 minutes? Definitely was surprised by the 40 minutes, I mean, but at the same time, we have about six, seven guys. So, I mean, we're foul trouble sometimes and one point guard, so. I had, it had to be something to, um, to happen, so I guess he, he was he was rocking with you. You said you had always been a Grizzly fan. What did you think about the atmosphere in the building? Oh man, this this I always dreamed of coming to a Grizzly game since I was about 13 years old, and just to actually not come to a game to actually be a part of one was a big big milestone in my life. So I'm definitely gonna remember this for for many years. To come. How have the older guys helped you? Yeah, kind of that's what, you know, Coach came here and told me. Bought the rest of the tickets, uh, Like I say, we shorthanded. It's like this is the time when we pull it together the most. We started the show. Like, uh, we started to trust one of the bills, trust, you know, game in, game out. So, uh, unfortunately for the guys, it's hurt, but uh, I think we still got the mindset to just go out there and grind it out and, you know, try to play hard and play together for 48 minutes. You always talk about holding out on defense, but you end up switched on that pick and roll with AD and you're fronting him and you're not and you're you're doing a good job. Can you envision like this is a dude that's gonna Yeah, he all star. Probably one of the best centers in the league. Uh, but uh I don't know. It, it, it was a task I had to take on. Um uh, we come a makeshift team obviously with all the guys down. Uh, but it was it was 
rough guard in 611. <laughs> but I, I banged with him, I grinded with him, and uh, whatever the, the team needs me to do, like I say, I'm, I'm up for the challenge, and uh, I took advantage of the opportunity. Is this one of those nights that's like truly Memphis? I mean, you know, like. Most definitely. Uh, and like you see, um, Matt, he was all over the place, rebounding, assisting, he played point guard at some time. And uh, we even posted him a little bit. So, um, and just uh, each guy feeding off each other uh, on the defensive end. We didn't let. We didn't get discouraged when those guys got to making runs and things of that nature. We stayed in attack mode and stayed confident all the way. Tony, what did you think about the performance of Lance Stevenson and then of course Matt Barnes? Yeah, well, I was just saying, Matt Barnes was all over the place. He was playing through Lance. Those guys had it going, and uh, you know, each night it might be somebody different. So I think it, it makes other teams, you know, pay more attention to us instead of you know looking over. Us. Yeah, I know. Those guys got it going. Yeah, there. Yeah, 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 y